Accrington and Walthamstow Central due to a signal failure. TfL Rail is also part closed between Brentwood and Shenfield. That's due to planned work which is going on until May. Uh, the Circle Line also has some minor delays which has just popped up. It's another day of strikes on southern trains. Only 16 southern uh, trains will run today on the Catrum to Victoria Line. Eight in the morning, eight in the evening. So expect roads, the overground and underground to be busy. But at the moment if we look at the roads and look at the A13 into town it is busy uh, but just as usual I suppose. Look at the weather forecast now with Kate. Good morning. It's a reasonably mild start to the day, but don't be fooled. The temperature, it is going to slip away through the afternoon and feel much, much colder by the end of the day. Now, we've got a bit of cloud this morning, but that's moving away southeastward, accompanied by quite a fresh northwesterly wind. That wind, it is going to feel chilly later. We've got some bright spells, some sunny spells, but by the end of the day, the temperature colder than it is this morning, 6 or 7 Celsius. A cold night tonight, but tomorrow is what we're all looking toward. A band of rain sweeping across the south of the UK, falling in the most part as rain, but as we head through the afternoon into the evening, it mixes with cold air and could in turn fall as snow right about rush hour. Some, some very difficult driving conditions. And the Met Office has issued a yellow weather warning for some snow through tomorrow into tomorrow evening. So as we head through the rest of the week, it is going to get progressively colder, especially at night time. Potential for some snow Thursday evening into Friday morning, but some brightness for Friday and Saturday, but it is going to get colder. So there could be snow on the way. I'm back in half an hour.